Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. If you have a BMW 1 or 2 series, guys, with a, a engine N20 or N26, this is the gasoline four cylinder turbo engine, guys. That's a 2.0 liter engine. We'll show you guys the torque specs for the camshaft sprocket. So stay with us, that's what we'll be doing today. Timing chain, camshaft, vanus sprockets, guys. Now, quick introduction, that same engine, guys, has been used in multiple BMWs, including this 5 Series here, so that's why we'll be applying it on this one. Many people ask me, on 1 and 2 Series, guys, what are the torque specs for that camshaft sprockets for the intake and the exhaust? Stay with us and we'll cover that. Another thing, we're going to share, guys, something that can prevent you to pay five to ten thousand dollars on future repairs on that engine. Make sure you stay until the end. Every single car we get at the shop, including this one here, we make at least 200 videos, guys. We take them completely apart. Why? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, guys. If you need any special tools or parts, check out the link in the description of the video below and you can find, guys, all the tools and parts that we use. So we're putting it together now, guys, but I want to show you the uh, torque specs. Before that, check out that engine, guys, is known for timing chain failures. Certain years and models are affected. Uh, we have more on that uh, on the channel. Check it out. Ours failed at 87,000 miles. And if you want to see the whole timing chain removal and replacement video, guys, it's on our channel, How to Repair, guys. Our main channel, How to Repair, guys. So please, guys, check it out. Quite a bit of helpful information there. As you know, we have three channels on How to Repair, guys. You'll find the main video, guys. That's our main channel. Now, when you get the camshaft sprockets tight, guys, you have to use the timing tools. Okay, timing tools have to be used, and you can find more information on that uh, in the timing chain installation video, so please check it out. You will need a torque wrench, and always advise your service manual for your specific vehicle, year, model, configuration, and engine configuration, guys, because things can be a little bit different. For ours, guys, what we found, and most of the ones with the N20 engine, we found that First step, set the torque wrench at, wrench at 55 Newton meters. You're going to get the bolts uh, tight, excuse me, at 55 Newton meters. You hear a click. Step number two, guys. Okay, step number two, you need to go ahead and uh, get the bolts tight extra 55 degrees. So quarter revolution, okay, is 90 degrees. So 55 degrees is like a little bit less than two thirds of one quarter revolution. So you can get the idea, guys. All the tools and parts that we use in our videos, including timing chain replacement tools, all that stuff, guys, new timing chain kit, all that will be shared in the description of the video below for your convenience. If you guys have another questions, let us know. Uh, we made that video based on comments and people asking us about it. So hopefully, guys, the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time.